here we are. I had to reboot the um, PC. I mean, um, laptop because um, it had been a. There's an update. Well, two big updates actually. One PC related and one um, network related. So um, this is the updated system software version you're viewing me from at present. Just for the technical record I'm making there. I normally wouldn't say it, but it was a, it was a big up update, bigger than usual. It was the operating system. That, that's what um, made it last long. Anyway, this is to do with oncology, as it says on the screen there, which is a branch of medicine that deals with the prevention, diagnosis and treatment of cancer. So it's got a Greek origin, the word. And it, um, I looked that up because of um, what today's video is about. And that's... Um, This is a um, memory card thing, reminder card, I think. The actual um, the actual video is about this blue book. It's quite a thick book, really. It's got a whole bunch of pages. I never really counted, but it's got um, 80 odd pages. <sighs> this is uh, like um, what you fill in when you need to. And the, um, the oncology nurses, as in the cancer clinic, they also do it. They do it, I suppose on site whereas I would do it at home. I put a bit of stuff in here, not much, because um, I'm busy doing other things. And the important thing is what the um, medical professionals put in, not me. Not yet anyway. Maybe not ever. So this is the book I was given by the uh, clinician after my first um, cancer doctor's review uh, meeting I had regarding um, when it was confirmed I had cancer. Before that it was like semi-confirmed. Uh, this is, I was given a bunch of papers actually and one book I picked up which I, I come to and another video, this one I was given by the uh, specialist. Mm. It's, um, it's, a, it's a quality book. If you look at the paper, the quality of the paper in it, it's very colourful. It's got my hospital number, consultant name, and specialist nurse name. Hmm. And on the inside you get things like this. Well, some of it is like stuff you read and some of it is stuff that you write in. The glossary I'm most looking forward to um, seeing, I mean reading. But there's all sorts of interesting things here that you can like, your eye catches as you flip through it. I'm not... Um, 
of the uh, mine to like dive into it as soon as I got it all later on because I wanted to have something spare to read at a key time plus it wasn't essential so when I go into hospital next I'm going to bring it with me then I've got something to read I did bring it in the last time I was there but I had other things to do so I did those things but this is a good backup this book give you something it, it gives you something uh, related to read rather than a side issue or completely unrelated because I went through a local newspaper uh, to pass the time when I was having my chemo my uh, second treatment uh, and uh, it took longer than I expected but that's good because I needed to um, I needed to pass the time and uh, I couldn't rely upon my phone because the battery went out. So I had this nice backup in the form of that book I just showed you. So it's actually a record as it says, cancer treatment record, but it's really a, in the form of a book. So it's got like a spine, you see. It's quite thick in its own way when you think about it. This is called a limp back book. They're like halfway between paperback and uh, um, hardback. Uh, that's a technical publishing thing that is, I'm saying there. It says at the bottom, please bring this information booklet to your hospital and GP appointments. I've just noticed that. I'd, I've only done that once. But, um, that's okay because it was it was early days, so it, it's not a problem if it's early if it's early days. And what what doesn't go into the GP section goes into the other section, so it's always made up for what you don't have put in at one point. It gets put in at another point, like days later, because the review is like one or two days before you actually do whatever it is the plan is and, um, and when you do that plan that's when the nurse fills in this book certain sections certain lines I mean when the treatment is over so um, you're going to get notes handwritten notes anyway at the doctor's review but the actual official uh, material in terms of the paperwork, which is this book. That's done by a cancer nurse in the uh, chemo clinic. Uh, and they always do that. And uh, they always fill in um, bits that weren't filled in before as well to make it more complete, which is good, because it's, it's like a treatment record, you know, like from start to finish. You know, I balanced it. I sort of balanced it on the top of the uh, laptop. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I'm um, I'm brushing my hair a bit today, and I'm a bit sort of semi-tired because it's been a long day. I sort of got up. Um, I got, I got up before noon. Uh, I should have stayed in longer in bed. Uh. But when you've got to get up, you get up. So I got up. And they had, had a couple of naps after that. Um, my scalp is starting to feel odd. It's the... Um, it's not the chemo. Or if it is, it's only a little part. It's that thing I got before that. The week before. Which is only two days before, actually, I think. Yeah, yeah, it was two days before. And that was that coaxi meab or whatever it's called. There's a video on it I did, um, I think, this week. So you just got to look up a video that begins with C with a weird looking word after the words cancer diary. Because that's the thing I'm talking about. 
It's very difficult to pronounce. But it begins with C. And it's got like A U and it, there's I think there's an X in it and a B. Maybe an M. And uh, that, that thing is it messed me up more than the regular chemo. But I didn't realise that because it had a delayed effect, like I mentioned before. Um I suppose it could be worse, some might say, but I've had to take um amoxicillin, which is um a very well established um, uh, antibiotic uh, several hours ago uh, to deal with the uh, problems it caused. It seems to be working, though it's a bit too early to say, to be fair. But I'll get back to that as an update um, in the evening tomorrow when I upload the next vid. <clears throat> Most probably, there might be a delay. Of a couple of days but I aim for there not to be the case. Right this is um, a video to um, finish off on the um, cancer treatment record book that you get in the UK via the um, NHS. It might have just struck my head you know because of the um, my scalp feels really odd. It's the um, it's that thing I mentioned. The one with a hard to say name. And it's not the Erotican, because I just said that easy. So it's not that. It's the other one I got. The um, the biological agent thing, as the doctor called it. All right, All right. We're coming up for a dozen minutes. That's probably double what I expected the video to be in uh, time wise so um, I better shut it down bye